Do you see here? Hi guys. I was just checking if it was recording because I'm sitting outside with my uh, with my laptop. And, uh, are you allowed to say laptop if it's Mac? <clears throat> I'm not quite certain. Anyway, yeah, it's uh, it's Father's Day, so happy Father's Day to all of you out there. I'm not going to repeat all the video I made before about Father's Day. But, uh, well, actually, I'm alone right now on Father's Day because uh, uh, Mrs. DC is working and uh, each of the boys are out on their own, uh, their own activity. Yeah, so, I am alone, yes, but I'm not alone because I'm with you guys. Nevertheless, <clears throat> sitting outside, mm, I'm just having a beer, enjoying a beer. I'm in the shade here. You can hear the birds. It's kind of nice. It really is, actually. Went to church this morning, and we had uh, one of our standard, uh, we call them apricults, which actually means uh, whatever. I mean, it's it's an apero. It's, uh, it's having a drink together with the people, so I stayed there for a while with my friends. I want to ask you a few things about uh, YouTube lately that are getting me actually quite annoyed. You know when you check your subs, like the queue, already it's difficult enough to follow up the queue, but in the last few days I've been noticing that I've been getting these videos that says, recommended for you because you listen to. And that's like every second video. So it's like doubling the queue, which means that I don't actually see everybody that's on there. So more and more, I'm going to have to go to every individual sub and say, send me an email when there's an upload. But that has the other consequence, and it just basically overloads the upload, I mean, the mailbox. I find that's actually a pain. But anyway, you know, I suppose that the idea is to help you to get to know other YouTubers. So there is something in there. Second thing that really ticked me off yesterday, I was at a friend's helping him out with some documents that he had to write up. And um, I wanted to show him a video. And I thought, okay, let's see, I'll show him the video where I was with uh, Susie. Uh, so, um, uh, oh goodness. It was the one on the Johnny Cash. Where we had not not the uh, not the vlog that I made with Susie, but where she had made a video for me, and it was the making of the Ring of Fire. Went over there, and what did I see? The audio is muted on this video. There was a yeah a copyright problem, and I was told that either either I could remove it, either I could uh, leave it muted. Or either that I could put on a YouTube, you know, the music track or whatever. Now, this video had me and Susie talking in the beginning, me and Susie talking at the end, and in the middle, the, uh, the video that she had made for me while I was singing uh, The Ring of Fire. So it muted the whole thing. Now, what, what kind of ticks me off is that I have that karaoke on my own channel in another form. No problem. Well, yeah, you get this third-party content thing, but there was no problem. Susie's got it on her channel. As far as I know, there's no problem. But I got basically a warning that my account was not in good standing if I kept this. And if anything, I certainly do not want, certainly do not want to lose my Dago Cleo account. So. Yeah, I took it off. That really hurt. It really hurt. I like that video, and it was fun. It showed the fun that we had. But yeah, I mean, I just don't want to lose that account, that's for sure. So I took it off. Have any of you had this problem happen to you before? It is a real, real, real pain. Because, I mean, I don't... I agree, I mean, there's the whole thing about the copywriting, I can understand that, but at least be, you know, logical, I mean, in this case, there was talking before and after, and I mean, I know that the same song is at least two other places, with me singing, with the same music, 
no big deal. So why was it this time? I don't know. Anyway, so that, that's one little thing. Where are we getting on in a minute here? Let's see. Can I find that out? Uh, okay, I've already spoken five minutes. So what's up for you guys on Father's Day? Are you having a barbecue? Are you having a meal together with the, with your parents, with your dad, or with your children? Okay. Later on, I mean, well, like I say, my boys are both absent for diff for various reasons, so they won't be there very much today. One actually is suffering from a really bad toothache right now. So yesterday we're trying to find him an emergency dentist and probably possibly something today. You know, it's hard to find an emergency dentist here. I'm uh, digressing, but it is very hard. You can go to an ordinary... If you have anything else, you go to the hospital to the emergencies or whatever. But if you have something with your teeth, it's like you have to suffer. Yeah, I don't know why it is that way. Mrs. DC is out working, so she'll be later on home. And then we'll make a barbecue together. It's Sunday night, but for her it'll be like her... How could I put it? It'll be like her Friday. And, uh, yeah. So we'll spend some time later on. Anything else? Well, not really. I guess that was just because I just want to have a chat with you guys and ask you a few of those questions, like I mean, the annoyances I find of YouTube lately. And, yeah. I was sad to take that video off. I really liked it. And it was a collab. I hate taking off videos. I mean, I haven't had to do that before, actually. But this type, and to remove a collab like that, yeah. But, well, my channel's still more important for me in that respect. Okay, so anyway, dads out there, happy Father's Day. Wishing you all the best. And uh, for those of you, well, that aren't dads, <laughs> well, just have a great day. It's Sunday. We have great weather. I hope you do as well. Okay, that'll be DC signing off. And if I can find where to turn this thing off, I'm going to click. That's the whole thing when you're outside. Okay, bye. Take care.